like charms. Here's Mike. He runs a grocery store. Bubble cereal is available in a super large box. Bubble cereal is also available in a super small box. Now some crazy kids made a big mess in the cereal aisle. <laughs> five big boxes and ten little boxes. Five big boxes and ten little boxes. So that's the answer. How many boxes of cereal are there? Five big boxes and ten little boxes. They're not like charms. Boxes of cereal seem similar, but they're not the same, so we count them differently. Is three the same as nine? No. Oh. The threes and nines are a mess. Let's clean them up. Sixteen threes. How many nines are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There are twelve nines. So there are sixteen threes and twelve nines. Sixteen threes. Sixteen times three. Twelve nines. Twelve times nine. Now, since 3 and 9 are not the same, they are not like terms, so you count them separately. So here's a question. What is another way of writing 9? 9 is the same as 3 squared. Hmm. 9 is 3 squared. 9 is 3 squared. 9 is 3 squared. 9 is 3 squared. 9 is 3 squared, 3 squared, 3 squared, 3 squared. Just replacing all of the 9s with the 3 squared. There, all the 9s are now 3 squared. Oops, not all of them. There we go. All of the 9s are now 3 squared. That is equivalent. Okay, so if 3 and 9 are not the same, then 3 and 3 squared are not the same. So is 5 and 5 squared the same? No. Is 7 and 7 squared the same? No. Is 8 and 8 squared the same? No. 
So how about if we replace that three with an X? Okay, X is gonna be three. So all the threes are gonna turn into X's. Okay, so now I have X's instead of threes. There, now I have X's instead of threes. Hmm, did I get all the threes? Oh wait, three squared is now X squared. X squared, three squared is now X squared. Replacing all of the threes with X squared, the three squareds are now X squareds. Oh, one more. Since three and three squared are not the same, X and X squared are not the same. X and X squared are not like terms.